All right. Um, also, there's a chat feature here where you can click on and, and chat with other students who might be online. Sometimes students um, like to have little study groups, and the chat thing is a, is a great way to do that as well. So um, that's kind of a quick rundown of the, the training system and the forums. Um, and again, you have access to the recordings and the, the live sessions for as long, and the forum uh, Q&A for as long as you'd like. All right, let's go back to the home page here just to take just a few minutes to answer some other questions. Um, so we talked about the, um, the webinars, the on-demand, um, the interaction with me and other students. Um, also, if you like certification uh, from ExcelMe, you can, um, there's a homework and or um, a final project for every course. And so if you need certification for reimbursement or just to have a nicely framed certificate uh, from ExcelMe on your wall, um, you do the homework and the project and the time frame is your choosing. And um, you email that information to myself and uh, you usually get the certificate within a couple weeks is mailed out to you. Um, it's all explained also when you do the course. At the very beginning, I explain what the uh, final project and the homework is and um, in order to get the certificate. Forum access is where you can go ahead and, um, again, access the training center and look at the forums and have access to the courses as well. And um, let's just kind of go ahead and take real quick just a look at one of the sample um, courses here. Again, let's go back to... I don't know, interject uh, to object-oriented programming, or we'll look at Objective-C 2.0, class number two. And you go ahead and hit play here. And sometimes, depending on your internet speed, it takes a few minutes to completely download. Good evening, everyone. And you can go ahead, like you would expect, to maximize it. Class number two. Hope everybody's doing well. You've had a chance to review the chapters that we're going to cover tonight. I hate listening to my own voice, so like I think most people do, but anyway, I'll kind of hop ahead here. Usually what I do as I'm going through the courses is I'll either start off with my presentation and the homework first, and then I'll hop into code, or I'll hop into the code first and then get into my presentation. It all depends here on what I'm doing, kind of taking you through the important parts of whatever we're talking about, and, um, and then going through the code and what the project is for that particular class. So it looks like on this one here, I'm going through the presentation here first um, on Objective-C. And if I get just a second here, I can hop in through. Uh, we're going through basic data types for Objective-C. Exciting stuff, I know, but important stuff for, uh, for software development. Let's see if we can't get a few more minutes ahead here. And uh, and it's all recorded um, in studio quality, so you're getting it in a, in a very good quality, both in the resolution on the screen, and also in the um, the audio as well. So it's a it's, you're just not listening to the phone recordings. And I really started doing that here in the last couple of months with the new with the classes, um, just because I I found another way to to better record them and utilize the technology that we have. Uh, so, you know, here we are, we're going through some code, and I go through and I explain it and run the code um, and answer students' questions as well. So, hopefully that answered your question. And again, I'm going to have a YouTube video for each course that walks uh, walks you through introduction to um, that particular course and, and what it's for and how, you're, um, how you how um, you succeed in being a, a developer uh, for the iPhone, the iTouch, and iPad. All right, also, uh, let's see. I've updated the courses. You get the most information, uh, updated information, and of course you can contact me at any time and take the courses as often as you like. Uh, you can click on, uh, if you want to follow me on Twitter, I always post any new technology updates as soon as they come out. I post them on Twitter. Believe me, I don't post things like, um, you know, I'm going to see a movie tonight, all right? It's all, all technology related. And then on LinkedIn, if you want to go and learn a little bit more about myself and my experience, uh, you can... Um, Join me on LinkedIn or click on the link. Um, I think you need to have a LinkedIn account, though, to, uh, to do that. Let me just uh, mute that in the background. And then also Facebook and Twitter as well. And um, also, if you'd like to see what other students have said about uh, my classes, um, I always solicit the students at the very end 
uh, for recommendations on what they thought. A number of my students have written successful iPhone applications that have been uh, within the top 100, um, and one has been in the top 10. Actually, two have been in the top 10 uh, for their particular class or for their particular um, genre, and um, one has been number one under I think it was lifestyle. Anyway, so you can go ahead and read all about that under my testimonials. And again, to sign up for the courses, you just click on the course that you're interested in or the schedule and um, add it to your cart. If you see here sold out or four seats left, the reason I do that is I limit that particular course, um, the number of live students. Uh, because it just some I like to keep the classes relatively small for uh, good student uh, teacher interaction. So if you see that it's either sold out or there's only a couple seats left, just um, go ahead and sign up for the other course and um, you'll get into um, that particular course's next live live uh, session. And if you really need to get into it, uh, the live session, if it's going on, just um, go to the contact us and shoot me an email or give me a phone call and um, I'll see what I can do. All right. And as far as, um, you know, I know things come up in people's lives. And so if you need things delayed uh, and uh, would like to retake the course at some other time after you've already signed up, again, you have it for as long as you access for as long as you'd like for the courses. Um, and same with refunds. Um, I know things come up and um, just uh, just let me know. So I'm pretty flexible and I understand uh, understand uh, different needs uh, from students come up from time to time. I'm not a formal university, so I have full flexibility in uh, making sure that you get uh, what you need and are successful in becoming a great iPhone, iPad, iTouch developer. Again, this is Gary Bennett. If you have any questions on any of our courses, including our marketing games um, for the iPhone, iTouch, let me know. And I uh, look forward to having you in my courses. Thanks again for tuning in and um, look forward to seeing you. Thanks. Bye.